Hey guys, and welcome back to another Diablo 4 video. My name is Dwight Stoney, and today I'll be showcasing the Eye Sorcerer, which is going to be my part two with my Eye Sorcery build. So right now it's currently beta, which is March 17th. Uh, I'll be running the Sanguine Chapel in the beta. And yeah, let's get straight into the video. Like I said previously, I will be showcasing a series where I use all the sorceries in the sorcery tree in Diablo 4. So I'll be showcasing Flame, Lightning, and now Ice, which is going to be the last build. And yeah, we'll be playing our Necromancer in the next beta. So let's go over the gear loadout, the skill tree, and the ability breakdown. So first things first, all of our gear is legendary. Anything associated with Ice, I equip. So I only have two rares and the rest are legendaries. For my abilities and my skill tree, I run... Rank 5 Frostbolt with Enhanced Frostbolt. So if I auto attack them and they freeze, they explode. I will be running Rank 1 Ice Armor. Rank 5 Frost Nova. Rank 5 Ice Blades, which is a Conjuration. Rank 5 Blizzard, which is our Mastery. And then our Ultimate, which is Deep Freeze. Now for the Ability Breakdown, I'll show you the abilities. So our basic attack is Frostbolt, which is our auto attack. Next is going to be our Frost Snow, which is an AoE Frost Field. So it presents anything that comes towards us. Next is going to be Ice Armor, which gives us the armor of ice. Next is going to be Blizzard. So anything that comes into the debris field is going to get slowed and eventually freezes. It's really long. And then uh, next is going to be Ice Blades, which, uh, which summons a conjuration of ice, ice swords. So that's what it looks like so they just run around and attack things and uh yeah our ultimate's gonna be deep freeze just like our part one which i already showed you so let's get straight into the sanguine chapel and i'll show you how the kit works so we're gonna open up with a blizzard and then we'll use uh frost field to to, to freeze all the enemies so let's keep getting these mobs Alright, so open up freeze field, freeze everything, and then they're all frozen. So, as you can see there, I can, uh, I, I just summon a field of blizzard on top of the, top of the frost, the frost field. And they freeze, so they take the damage. They take the damage over time from the blizzard. So I just freeze them in Frost Nova and then they, they die in the debris field. So. Yeah. There we go. And they all freeze. And then I, I just auto attack them to death. So, and then they explode. This build is really good because uh, it's like mana conservation and it's good crowd control. So I'll use Ice Field to protect myself. And it just explodes. So, it's a really strong build. It's a really good beginner build, in my opinion. I'd say if you're starting off with the sorcerers, to start off with the ice tree. And then you can do uh, flame sorceries into lightning, because I think lightning is the hardest to use in the game. Because the the uh, some of the lightning sorceries is melee oriented, so you need to learn how, to, how, how they work uh, together with the other abilities. So... Ice field. And then with uh, that, I'll be using frost field, and then just auto attack so they explode with the frost ball. It's really good because uh, the mana costs are really cheap, and it just deals a lot of fucking damage. So they just explode when they freeze up. So I really like this build. If I personally had to choose, I'd say my favorite is Blizzard right now. Compared to uh, fire, like, because uh, it, it's just it's really easy to just like not mess up with blizzard. Very safe, very safe uh, skills to use. I like this build. This is like my sub zero build. Yeah. 
Very good for close quarters, crowd control. All right, cool. All right, awesome. Dude, they just explode. Right when you, oh, right when you freeze them. When you use your ultimate on top of your basic abilities, this build is probably the most broken, the broken build in the game. I'd say. For the uh, ice sorcery, I really, I really like it how it works. Like you just freeze everything, and they just die. It's really nice. So fucking slow, he can't fucking get me. Nice. Easy. Easy. This build's so broken. Like all the elites can't kill you. Who crew diamond? Get that. God, this shit's so broken. Right through the door. Yeah, this build's broken. This is definitely my favorite build in the game right now. Like freezing everything to fucking death. It's like fucking watching them explode. It's great. I got one key here. I need time to do that. I'm like a Lich King, man. Fucking Diablo. So broken. Oh shit. Okay, I jinxed myself. Freeze myself. What I get? Oh, I got an orb. Nice. Dreamcatcher conflagration. Legendary focus. Oh, it's good for incinerate. Okay, I'll use it.
very nice. and everything. Nice. I should be using Spectral Boy a lot more. Very nice. Alright, this is the last mechanical box and should be the boss. Yeah, this build is actually really fucking broken. Like, I, I I, haven't, you know, like, been past, like... I haven't been under, like, 50% 50 HP because of how broken the crowd control is with the ice. I need time to do that. Very cool. Oh, I need time. Yeah. Holy shit, fat ass is fucking frozen. <laughs> yeah. I'm not ready yet. Yeah. Very nice. Okay. All right. All right, we're almost done with the dungeon. This boss fight's gonna be epic. Follow the undercraft. Mm. Damn, these are like a lot of mobs.
Very nice. The cooldowns might seem really long, but the crowd control just makes it like really short. That's where the boss is. Anytime. Those two ending like monsters remind me of the Titan from Resident Evil. I need time. Oh shit, I got launched. I think that's everything. Okay, so those are all the mobs. Nice. Yeah, this build's really nice. I really like it. This is definitely my favorite build in the beta for the sorcery. I need more time. Okay, boss fight. Blood like Bishop. Shit, that was God, I never fought this boss yet. I need time. Oh, nice. Got some. Broken as fuck. I'm not ready yet. Ultimate destroyed all those uh blood 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 sacks. I'm not ready yet. Nice. Dude, that boss fight is pretty sick. 
I I'm tired of fighting werewolves. Like, I actually fought like an actual demon. All right, nice. Well, that was it, guys. Uh, this was the final series in the video where I showcased all of the sorceries in the Sorcerer of Diablo 4. And yeah, so those were all the abilities in a nutshell. So yeah, that was the Chamber of Morality and the Exorcist's Catch. And yeah, that was the Diablo 4 beta for the Sorcerer. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next beta where I do a playthrough of the Necromancer. And I'll be, I'll be making more build videos upon release of the full game. Hopefully you guys enjoy the series and I'll see you in the next beta. All right guys, peace out.